McGee TV. TV. Welcome back, McGee TV viewers. I've got a very special unboxing for you this time. This package right here I just got in the mail today from Fan Gamer. I've been waiting for this one with a lot of anticipation. When I first heard about this collector's edition, I was on Fan Gamer all the time, day after day after day, trying to find out when this thing was going to be available for pre-order. So the second I found out it was available, I, I, I pre-ordered it almost immediately. I, I would say I was probably within the first hour of when it became available. I'm so used to things just kind of disappearing when they hit limited run, so I didn't want to take that chance with Fan Gamer. So I, I snatched this up as soon as I could, and it's finally come in the mail to me. Actually, it's gotten here a lot sooner than I thought it would. I, I didn't think I'd be seeing this towards until towards the end of the year. So I am super pumped about this one. Let's just go ahead and dive right in. All right, so let's check it out. Now one thing I want to take note of as I'm opening this up, I ordered two items that didn't necessarily come with each other, it was an option. Basically they offered me a discount on an art book if I picked it up with the collector's edition so I went ahead and snagged that too because it was a nice $10 off. And I just love a deal. So that is what we're going to see here. Undertale art book. Oh, check it out. <laughs> Dog on the back. It's a Toby Fox icon there on the back. Really cool. I'll open that up. Let's go ahead and take a look at that first. if you can quite see that or not but that is a whole bunch of little dogs a whole bunch of little Toby Fox dogs all in the background there which is really really cool and table of contents and then uh, we've got, uh, got the fan gamer logo right there which is cool Oh, it's got some messages from the creators. Every video game has concept art. Undertale is no exception. I guess the difference here is that I'm not an artist. Hope you enjoy the glimpse into the world of Undertale anyway. Oh, I could barely read that. It actually says lol. <laughs> and you got Toby right there. Enjoy the art. I hope the things I made printed okay because I had no idea what uh, CMYK was when I was drawing this stuff. I don't know. But uh, that's Temi. Temi, uh, the artist for Undertale. So we got areas. Okay, so cool. This is like showing some of their sketches for what the game was going to be like. This one right here is mentioning that uh, Ian was going to be like MP for spells, but I never used it. So that's an interesting little insight there into the, the creation of the game. I really love uh, Temi's uh, sketches right here. They're really cool. I am thoroughly going to enjoy looking through this one. Very, very cool stuff. I like how they have really rough sketches mapping out the basic idea and then I imagine as I as I turn through this you know some of these are going to become more detailed some flowery toriel 
Look at all the little tutorial art. Adorable. Papyrus. <laughs> Spaghetti. That is awesome. And of course, Sans, my favorite character. He had an idea of him having a visor or a hat at one point. That's interesting. The annoying dog. And it's just a bunch of annoying dogs. I mean, they're really isn't much else to it <laughs> which works that works and then Temmie it's very very cool Undyne interesting Alfie's Mediton. Very cool stuff. So let's go ahead and get to our main event here. And that is this baby. Which looks like I can slide that out maybe. Uh, we tried. Yeah. And there you have it. The Undertale Collector's Edition for PlayStation 4. As well as, it looks like we've got some interesting stuff here for Fan Gamer. So we've got the annoying dog right here as a sticker, which is really rad. Let's see, golden flowers, they must have broken your fall. Oh, okay, cool, check that out. Nice, this little postcard. We got uh, our protagonist there, very cool. And then, Advertisement for some more things from Fan Gamer and some more really cool Undertale stuff, and soundtracks and buttons, and then their uh, their Undertale figurines. I think those are really cool. I think I might get me a few of those someday. I think those are really neat. But let's go ahead and check out what we got here in the box. So as you can see right there on the front, we got this locket. Uh, tape. More tape. More tape. Yeah. Drop that like that. And here is our locket. And it is a wind up music box. And that is the main theme to Undertale. And there's the music box on the inside. Beautiful. And of course the game. right there you can see the city 
the friendly RPG where nobody has to die. I love it. Flowey. Very cool. There's the game. Oh wow, check that out. We've got, uh, uh, there's the annoying dog. Oh, actually, that's a reversible cover. Check that out. <laughs> also, Undertale. <laughs> I don't know why, but I find that very funny. <laughs> Book. Look at that. Wow. I love how it's got like this this children's book quality to the side of it. Reminds me of like these little books that they had when uh, I was uh, very, very young. Got Flowey on the back right there. Got Kara falling. Check that out. Long ago, two long ago, two races ruled over Earth, humans and monsters. Oh, uh, that's cool. So this is like the the intro sequence, but in uh, but in book form, which is really really cool. Very cool. So, you might have noticed I got this in the box too. This is the Collector's Edition soundtrack. We've got Sands on the front with a tuba, Toriel's right there, see Metaton right there in the background. And there goes Papyrus and Alfie's. And <laughs> Boo right there. Very cool. Oh, I don't have to, it's not covered in plastic, so I don't have to cut it open. There's the soundtrack CD, both soundtrack CDs, I should say. It looks like there's some artwork on the inside. Ah, oh, check it out, it's in full color. Isn't that awesome? Very, very cool. i got a book with this as well. Oh, check it out. It's the sheet music. Upon a time, falling down. It's interesting because he he's got uh, some notes in here talking about uh, the process of making the music and his inspirations. Like my main inspiration was the game over theme from Zelda. One, I liked how strangely soothing it felt. It's kind of cool. So he's got a little bit of information on. Uh, the thought process for for some of these tunes by Toby Fox. Hopes and dreams, memory. Very very cool stuff. Well, there you have it. That's uh. The Undertale Collector's Edition from Fan Gamer. It's got lots of really awesome stuff in it. And uh, I highly recommend that you check out some of the other really awesome Undertale stuff that you can find there. And as always, thank you so very much for tuning in and have a great one. Please let me know if you enjoyed this video by commenting below or visiting us at mcgeetv.com.
or on social media at McGee underscore TV on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Also, check out Evan and myself on Twitch at McGee underscore TV and XX Scissor XX Gaming. Finally, please like and subscribe for future content. And as always, thanks for watching.